Today we will show you how to set up your Cocoon HD application for remote viewing. Before configuring a remote viewing, you'll need to make sure that the DVR is connected to a network. This can be done by connecting the Ethernet cable directly into a router. Please note that when logging into the DVR for the first time, the factory default is admin and the password is left blank. To change the login details, please see our other videos. To test the internet connection, go into the main menu, setup, network, and click the test button. If it says OK, you're good to go. If not, then please consult your manual. Please ensure that the obtain an IP address automatically is ticked. To download the application, open up your iTunes store or your Google Play store and search Cocoon HD. Once the download has completed, open up the application. The application may ask for permission to send you notifications. Click allow or don't allow depending on your preference. To register a new user, click the register button down the bottom of the screen. Then enter in a valid email address. Once you have entered in a valid email address, press the get button next to the enter validation code. This will send a validation code to the email address. Once you have received the validation code, enter it into the enter validation code section and click next. Next, enter in a secure password. This will be the password you use to log into the application. Please note that the login details for the DVR will be different to the login details for the application. Once you have filled out your password, press the register button. Once successfully registered, you will now be able to log into the application. Please note your DVR's username and password cannot be used to log into the app. To add a new device, press the plus symbol in the top right hand corner. Scan your device's QR code. The device QR code can be found by going into the main menu, Information, then System. Ensure that the third QR code is scanned. The application may ask for permission to use your camera. Click Allow. The device password is the password you use to log on to your physical DVR. The device name could be anything you choose, from home, office, or other. Once all details have been filled out correctly, press the tick in the top right hand corner. Once completed, your device will be added to the main screen and will say online. If your device is offline, please consult the manual. To view your cameras, click any one of the three squares showing up on the main menu. Please note, if a camera is disconnected, it will show up as a black screen. To access individual cameras, press the icon in the top right hand corner and select the desired camera. Once you have set up remote viewing through the application, you can now easily view your cameras through the PC application. To log into the PC application, you'll need the same login details as the mobile phone application. Once you have logged in, press the arrow next to the preview button on the top left hand corner. From here, double click the area then double click the device name, then right click and play all. Your camera should now be live. Follow our YouTube channel or our Facebook page for future updates and more videos.